This second Sunday health report video footage was filmed prior to COVID-19. Ruth Van Gerpen is due for her routine colonoscopy. Checking in for her procedure, she invites us to follow her through the commonly feared examination. This to me was an opportunity to be able to show them and let them see, let them kind of be in my shoes for the day as they walk along beside me from the beginning. Van Gerpen is an oncology nurse. She's public about the procedure to highlight its importance and to show us there's nothing to be afraid of. You honestly don't feel anything. It starts with prep, the most important step. Leading up to the examination, you limit your diet to clear liquids and medicine that cleans out your colon. You know, I always tell people the quality of their tests is directly proportional to the quality of their preparation. If I get in there and can't see very well, I can't do a very good job for them. During the actual test, you're out under sedation. You can see how Van Gerpen is in a conscious sleep state where she feels nothing. Then the gastroenterologist uses a camera to view your colon. To distend the bowel, we have to be able to distend the bowel so we can actually see the surface as well. Doctors look for polyps on the colon that could lead to cancer, and they work to remove them. A polyp is a small growth. Polyps come in different varieties. There are sessile or very flat polyps. When the doctor is done, nurses wake Van Gerpen up. She can go home that day. It's important to keep up on your preventative care appointments, especially during the pandemic. As a reminder, you should start getting colon screenings at age 45. If you have a family history of colon risk, doctors recommend an earlier exam.